Hi everyone! The cartoons from our childhood portray wild animals as friendly and cute creatures. However, in real life, one shall stay away from them. Such an encounter can result in unpredictable consequences and serious injuries. But there are exceptions to this rule. Today, we will tell you several stories when wild animals risked their own lives to save a human. Let's get it on! Lions have a matriarchal society. Lionesses are usually responsible for raising cubs and hunting. In this video, the lioness established her unconditional authority. Just take a look at that. Everything seems to be in perfect order. The huge king of the jungle rests behind the glass of the zoo, surrounded by two employees, when suddenly, for no reason, he decides to attack one of them. He tries to fight the lion off and escape. At that moment, the brave lioness rushed to his aid and calmed the male down. The lion then runs away from the crime scene. Biologists call this huge animal a humpback whale. It is considered one of the most musical and agile cetaceans because he makes unusual loud sounds and jumps out of the water to show off peculiar acrobatic moves. The humpback whale has a reputation for altruism because he often helps to save the lives of other creatures. Marine biologist Nan Hauser says that a humpback whale once saved her from a tiger shark attack during a recent expedition to the Cook Islands in the Pacific Ocean. When Hauser saw a giant 23-ton humpback whale swimming nearby, she decided to approach him. Then, to Nan's surprise, the mammal suddenly started to tuck her under his pectoral fin and even tried to lift her up out of the water. The research team did not immediately realize that a huge whale directed them away from danger, which they didn't even notice at first. The whale kept behaving weird for a full 10 minutes. As Nan recalls, all this time another whale who happened to be nearby helped his relative and distracted the predator with the help of his tail fin. Only a couple of minutes later did Nan realize that her life really was in danger. She saw another whale in the distance that kept tail slapping. However, the whale tail fin usually moves up and down, while the shark fin moves from left to right. That's how Hauser realized a tiger shark was nearby. According to Hauser, who has been saving whales for many years, her story is one of the many proofs of how altruistic the humpback whales are. Various sources say that these mammals often risk their own lives in order to save other species that are not even related to them. The man in this video devoted almost his entire life to research and rescue of dolphins and other marine life. Unfortunately, Hardy Jones passed away last year, but he could have died much earlier if not for his dolphin friends who repeatedly saved the researcher during his risky dives. This footage proves that. This video was taken when Jones was on an expedition to the Bahamas. You can clearly see how the bloodthirsty hammerhead shark swims near the diver, probably waiting for the right moment to attack. Hardy, of course, as a person truly passionate about his work, continues to film the predator on camera as if nothing threatens his life. At this moment, four young dolphins whom Hardy knew personally rushed to drive the hammerhead off. The researcher knows. The dolphin saved him from the attack of a marine predator. It's not surprising. Throughout his entire career, Hardy tried to make the life of these amazing mammals better. He also directed about 75 fascinating films about the creatures of the deep sea, which were shown on Discovery and National Geographic channels. Another touching example of a man's friendship with a dolphin is the incredible story of long-distance swimmer Adam Walker. He encountered marine creatures many times during long swims. In 2012, during a 17-hour swim in Hawaii's Molokai Strait, he was nearly shot out of the water after being stung by a Portuguese manowar, a jellyfish-like sea creature whose venom is similar to that of a cobra. Two years later, Adam encountered a far greater danger while swimming in the Cook Strait in New Zealand. This time, it was a large white shark that can sometimes reach up to 7 meters in length. Adam noticed it when he caught a glimpse of a huge dorsal fin sticking out of the water, but continued to swim. Then, something incredible happened. Suddenly, out of nowhere, a pod of dolphins appeared next to the swimmer. They swam to Walker's rescue by surrounding him as the monster prepared to attack. Ten of them closed tight around the swimmer and escorted him for the next 90 minutes, only leaving him when he was safely out of harm's way. After a while, the shark completely lost interest in the swimmer, and eventually went away to find easier prey. If it wasn't for his new friends, Adam wouldn't have crossed the strait, which took him 8 hours and 36 minutes. 
By the way, Adam Walker is the first Briton to complete a Seven Oceans Challenge. According to him, dolphins swim six times faster than an average Olympic swimmer, so they had actually gone down to his speed to protect the swimmer. This proves that dolphins have not only intelligence, but also good hearts. At first, even the police didn't believe the story told by this old man from California. It seemed implausible. Robert Biggs is a fan of hiking. In other words, he enjoys taking walks in the wild. In the past, he had already encountered dangerous local animals, for example, venomous snakes. But he will definitely remember this day for the rest of his life. During one of his hikes, he was watching a large female grizzly bear playing with her cubs when he felt a sharp stab in the back. At first, he thought his friend was playing a prank on him, but when he turned around, he saw a fierce mountain lion in front of him. Nevertheless, Robert did not panic. He smashed the wildcat with his rock pick, which he used to climb rocks. The animal did not back down. Then something huge appeared on his left side. It was the grizzly mama bear who clashed with the wildcat in a deadly battle to save Biggs. The man got away with a couple of scratches and bruises, and the cat had to retreat into the woods. Biggs is certain that the grizzly mom recognized him from earlier encounters, and decided to risk her own life to rescue him from the predator. Thailand and several other countries washed by the Indian Ocean are prone to earthquakes and other natural disasters. For example, the devastating tsunami that struck Phuket in 2004 killed more than 300,000 people in Thailand and its surrounding areas. When an 8-year-old Amber Owen got on a plane to this exotic country where she wanted to spend the Christmas holidays, it never occurred to her this vacation would end in tragedy. But it could have ended much worse if not for the brave Ning Nong, the little elephant whom Amber befriended immediately upon arrival at the Sheraton Hotel on the coast of Phuket. On the morning of December 26, 2004, the girl, as usual, hurried to the beach to ride on the elephant's back along the shore. On that day, Ning Nong kept turning away from the sea and was anxious. The unsuspecting people were walking where the tide had receded, picking up fish and putting them in their bags. Soon, the first tsunami wave hit the coast, reaching a height of 15 meters. However, by that time, the elephant reached a high wall, where he wedged himself beside a stone shelf. However, by that time, the elephant reached a high wall, where he wedged himself beside a stone shelf so that Amber could climb up to safety. Thanks to this shelter, little Amber survived the first tsunami wave, which claimed the lives of many people. After this touching story made worldwide headlines, it has been made into a hit show, Running Wild. And three years ago, Thai journalists even found Ning Nong. The elephant is still alive and, according to her new owners, enjoys the company of people. For those who believe in Darwin's theory, this story can serve as yet another strong argument in its favor. In 1996, an eight-year-old gorilla, Binti Jua, rescued a little boy from the other inhabitants of the zoo, as if he was her own baby. A three-year-old visitor to the Brookfield Zoo in Chicago slipped away from his mother and fell through a barrier at the gorilla cage. Biologists believe gorillas are very strong and dangerous animals who are also territorial, but the frightened crowd was surprised to see that Binta Jua walked over to the unconscious boy, carefully picked him up, and carried him towards the exit from the cage, where the zoo employees were waiting for him. The boy suffered a broken hand and several grazes, but if not for the caring gorilla mother, everything could have ended much worse. This guy was literally on the brink of death when unexpected help arrived. In 2000, American Kevin Hines fell from the legendary bridge in San Francisco, flying a few tens of meters before he hit the water. He was fortunate not to die from the impact, but when he got into the icy stream of the Golden Gate Strait, he soon noticed a sea creature swimming underneath. It's important to note that this story happened in fall, when the temperature of the water is so low that 15 minutes in it is enough to kill a man. Kevin was sure that a bloodthirsty shark was swimming underneath, and he was ready to say goodbye to his own life. But suddenly, the animal began to push him to the surface. According to eyewitnesses, the sea lion did not let Kevin drown until a rescue boat appeared nearby. As Kevin puts it, this incident dramatically changed his outlook on life and made him learn to appreciate it again. He still recalls the story of his miraculous rescue with great appreciation, and sometimes even tells it at conferences around the world. That's it for today. See you soon!